So as you can see, I actually have the fiance here, mm -hmm. and we're actually gonna get uh, your take and my take on a fragrance that actually came out last year, 2016. Okay. Something that's been getting a lot of hype. Yeah. You know? So I really want to get your take on this one to see whether or not it really is a sexy scent because a lot of guys are saying this is a sexy scent, this is whatever, right? Mm -hmm. So we're actually gonna be doing Jean-Paul Gaultier Le Mans Essence de Parfum, okay? So I actually went through two samples. I'm not done them quite yet. I'm almost there. So I do want to save a little bit more juice for another video. So mm -hmm. because I actually got samples, let's just see a picture as to what it looks like and then let's get this started. Okay. All right, so the notes for this fragrance, so there's a lot of notes. So the top notes are cardamom, bergamot, with Ar Artemisia and pepper in the mid is lavender, leather, cinnamon, and sage with the base being something called Costas, amberwood, vanilla, and musk. Now, I actually sprayed this on my hand about 10, 12, 10 to 15 minutes ago. Mm -hmm. Is there anything of those notes that you get? Or is there anything else that you maybe get? I get more like a leathery scent. Okay, all mm -hmm. right. What did they have? Cardamom? Well, cardamom's in there. Leather is definitely in there. I think I get a little bit of cardamom, but I get more leather than anything. Okay. And cinnamon, okay. for sure. So. Oh, vanilla. I smell the vanilla. Do you know? Mm-hmm. The, the leather is very prominent. Though. It's very prominent, yeah. Yes. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, that's it? I think so. For my nose, that's all I can pick out, yeah. So, I definitely get a lot of cardamom, lots of leather. So, it's, it's more of a, like, a, I don't know if it's just my nose, but like a smoky, like a smoky leather yeah. type of feel. Yeah. Uh, but definitely a lot of van the vanilla with some, um, some cinnamon. Mm-hmm. Now this is a very masculine scent. I think it's sexy. Mm -hmm. Do you think it's sexy? Yes. Yeah? Mm -hmm. Do you think it's very masculine or is it kind of like unisex? No, it's certainly a masculine scent. I don't know if it would be sexy if I wore that. Okay. Because there's a difference between sexy for women and sexy for men, yes. right? Yes, yeah. Uh, it depends on how you carry it too, right? Okay, so, so like, would you say that, okay, for manly, like since it's masculine, would you say it's rugged, kind of like no, mature? Not this isn't rugged. This is, um, it has a little bit of, um, maybe a little bit of ruggedness to it. Maybe okay. because of the leather, you might think of it that way. But for me, it smells more like dessert, right? Really? Yeah, I know that there's a lot of leather in there and that's very prominent. Wow. But it's, it makes me feel warm and comforted. Okay. So, like I, when I smell these kinds of scents, I think of fireplace. Warm, yeah, okay, that kind of thing. All right, sure, like being cozy, mm -hmm. yeah, yeah. I really do think that this is sexy. This is the type of sexy where, like, a leather belt is like strapped me against the back of my, my bare butt cheeks in assless chaps. Like, oh that's my God. how sexy it is. Oh, like, how you is, guys have no idea. How is that for an image, huh? <laughs> yeah, that is sexy. You though. have a very vivid imagination, my darling. I had a lot of issues. <laughs> Not issues, just a vivid imagination. It did happen before, though, when I was younger, you know. Mm -hmm. But now I've grown up. <laughs> I'm still a man child and slightly a bit of a douchebag, right. uh, unfortunately, admit. Mm -hmm. But I've gotten a little bit more conservative. You've tried. You've come a long way. I have. Yeah. But, you know, I've experimented when I was younger. <laughs> <laughs> but yeah, it's a really, I think it's a very sexy, sensuous scent. It um, is a sensuous scent. Now, yeah. what would you say that occasion wise for, uh, for this one here? Well, close encounters. Yes. I think it'd be good for close encounters. I think it could be good for special occasions. Okay. Um, All right. I wouldn't wear this every day. Okay. I think that's what freshies are for, everyday wear. Definitely a great date night scent, but it has to be a classy, intimate date night scent. Okay. All right. Yeah. Um, I think that this would be a great clubbing scent, going okay. out scent, mm -hmm. um, you know. I'm not sure if it... I don't know why. I feel like clubby scents are more... Um, more spicy. This isn't so spicy. Really? This is warm. Okay. This is, yeah. Well, like one of the ultimate clubbing scents of all time would be the original. Oh, is Lumel. it? Yeah, that's okay. that was praised as one of the biggest club scents of all time. I see. Thing. Okay. Uh, this is a flanker. Lamal came out like 20 years ago. Gotcha. Uh, I think that this is much better than the original Lamal. Mm -hmm. It's not as sweet. Well, that one there is a little bit more. Uh, youthful, um, Maybe while this it. was a little, slightly like, mature, if you will. I feel like sweet scents. Okay. Should, sweet or spicy scents should probably be at the club. Okay. Yeah, well, because it's for the people. <laughs> there you go. Yeah. I do think that this would be a good clubbing scent. You know, you will stand out from some of the other people out there. Mm -hmm. uh, great going out. Uh, longevity right. was actually really good. Mm -hmm. 10 to, to 12 hours projection was 2 to 3. 
Uh, would you say that this is a fall or fall, winter, summer? Uh, I would say fall. Yeah. Fall. I don't think winter. I think winter is too cold. Really? I think, think that this would shine definitely in the wintertime. Okay. Fall and winter, uh, this will definitely cut through. The, I okay. find that because it's it's bold, it is loud, you know, mm -hmm. the spiciness, the, if there's some woods in there, I think I mentioned that there's some woods, the leather it will definitely cut through the cold. I find. Yeah, so even though it's a warm scent, I feel like maybe the leather might give it a bit more daringness to it. Yeah, okay. Mm -hmm. So prices on this one, so at the Hudson's Bay Company, I think it's going for about a hundred bucks or a little bit more, you know. This is a Noah de Patron, so you mm -hmm. will pay a little bit extra. Online, did not check, but you're really not going to get much of a deal on it just because it did come out last year or so. Okay. Um, so you think it's a very sexy scent. I do. Uh, some of the ladies at work, and yes, mm -hmm. I do ask some of the ladies at work, and, mm -hmm. but I have told them that I am engaged and yes. they are all married but one. Oh. So you're happily attached to your ball and chain. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yes, yeah. you are. Yes, you are. But my friend Jenny, who I'm hoping to get on camera, she, uh -huh. did, she did state that she would do a video with me. Okay. Jenny said her exact words that this is a cuddling scent. Yeah, so exactly. You, yeah, it's definitely yeah. a cuddling scent. So yeah, it, yeah. it is a sexy scent. It's close quarters as well. So as okay. you stated, it is close quarters. So, you know, cuddling mm -hmm. scent tends to, like, cuddling tends to lead to other things, am I right? Right. So, are there any final thoughts on this fragrance? Uh, not really. I think you captured most of them. You know, it's a cuddling scent. It's very, it's lovely. It's very warm, beautiful, sexy scent. Mm -hmm. I think that it's great for, you know, like, a couple that's been together for quite some time. Okay. Yeah. All right. So, if you were to give a rating out of five, what would you give this one? Out of five, I'd give it a five. I like, like this one. So you say that this is a like a perfect 5 out of 5, mm -hmm. like a 4 star, 10 out of 10. I can't think of anything mm. wrong with it. I wouldn't wear it every day. I'd be sick of it after Okay. All right. Yeah. Um, I like it a lot, mm -hmm. but uh, I don't I don't want to decant of yeah. it. You know, mm -hmm. um, it's just, even though I do like it quite a bit, it's just, I guess I'm at a, at a different stage in my life, you know, mm -hmm. I, I really don't want something like this, you know. This is laid back, you know, but something that's not seductive or sexy. I like, something, I like something that's a little bit more casual, classy, mm -hmm. and laid back. Fair enough. Mm -hmm. This is definitely ma masculine. It is kind of casual, but it's also uh, pretty sexy. So it's, mm -hmm. it's really not something that I would use for every day, you know, unless you're a jiggle. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. Alright, so that's it. So guys, that is our take of Jean-Paul Gaultier Le Mans Essence de Parfums. Mm -hmm. Sweetie, thank you very much for doing this video. So, Anytime. so we're definitely going to get her back. So guys, I know you like her and it definitely helps out with the channel because you definitely add some eye candy to it. Ah, Me? You're my eye candy. Yeah, what's wrong with you, woman? Oh, come on, you. <laughs> so guys, thank you for your time. T talk to you later. Take care. Bye, guys.